That is actually pretty cool. <laughs> I like that a lot more than I thought I would. Right, guys today we are back in Maslin Ohio at the Lowe's because the other day we had to cut it short because the guys were still setting stuff up we looked at all the animatronics and some awesome stuff in here the other day but today we're here to see the inflatables and everything else that we didn't see and I believe there's actually some more animatronics in there that we didn't see the other day in fact I know there are because they were still setting up a display when I had to walk out Yes, all of this is what we looked at the other day, and this is the stuff that was not set up yet, as well as what's behind it, all those inflatables on the wall. So let's get started with this enormous guy right here. Look, this is the 12-foot animated mummy. Look at his face. A lot of people are talking about this online because Home Depot has, you know, the 12-foot skeleton, the 12-foot witch, uh, I think they have like a nine foot werewolf. Um, this guy's 348 bucks. Look at the hands on him. They're absolutely enormous. And look at him just towering over me. Holy crap. Okay, so there's a try me button. Let's see what he does. That is actually pretty cool. <laughs> I like that a lot more than I thought I would. That is really, really cool, guys. Look, the lights flicker all the way up. And just the top of his torso goes back and forth. He doesn't talk. He just makes mummy sounds. But he is totally awesome. I love him so much more than I ever expected to. Now, there's no bulk to him because he's not a full skeleton all the way through. This is just simply the structure, a steel structure going up. So the only thing that's skeleton about him are the hands and the head. But I'll tell you what, he is pretty dang awesome. All right, let's go ahead and look at this guy here. Look, he's holding a, a hourglass animated reaper, seven foot animated reaper. There's a skull on top. Let's see what he does. Oh, look at the face on that guy. I did not expect that. I expected there to be like eyes inside there and if you look closely you can see the skull but yeah let's do it again that is pretty dang cool look at that he's turned down really low so you can't hear much of what he's saying but that is pretty dang cool then we got this creepy guy clown with a witch hat all right let's see what he does oh look at that he's a shaker a shaker and a mover <laughs> he said, you think I'm funny, you should look in the mirror. He's pretty cool, actually. I think that's the same thing that the, uh, that the hanging hugs said over there. Oh my gosh, I almost forgot about these giant skeletons over here. We'll get to those. All right, here's this chick. Animated, creepy, female. Oh my gosh. Okay, whoa! <laughs> That scared the living crap out of me. Let's just pull this hair away a second. Look at that. Look at that face. Oh my gosh, that is crazy. Let's do that one more time. Here we go. Animated creepy female. It jumps up so fast. This might have to be the, uh, the thumbnail right here. That is so creepy. Oh my gosh. Reminds me of Cousin It, though. Look at this. Yeah, with all the hair and all you can see is eyes. Reminds me of Cousin It. <laughs> That's awesome. She's only 80 bucks, too. That is really a good price for that. It's just an awesome little jump scare. Okay, what's next? We got the evil witch with a crystal ball. All right, there's her face. Let's see. Oh, here's the button for her. Here we go. She is awesome. <laughs> that 
That's the best witch laugh ever. Let's do it one more time because I got to show you the crystal ball. Look how the ball swirls. That is totally awesome. Oh my gosh, I love her so much. <laughs> She's 199. That is the best laugh I've ever heard on an animatronic witch. That is awesome. All right, and we got this guy who reminds me of the candy creep because he has the sucker. He That's about all that reminds me of the candy creep, though, but let's get him going. We'll see who has the last laugh. <laughs> Oh my gosh, that was awesome. Let's do it again. That's it. Come closer. I've got something for you. And it's not a balloon. <laughs> it's a sucker. Okay, let's do it one more time and get a wide shot. Go ahead. Run away. I'll just catch up with you later. In your nightmare. <laughs> he is pretty cool. I love his hair. It's almost spiky. And, uh, and I love his face. Everything about this guy is pretty cool. Even the sucker. Look at this. They've got two of those witches in stock, too. I love that thing. And what is this? Oh, this is the life-size animated reaper over here. So they have one of those in stock. we got to come back over here, though, for a minute. Because they got this ginormous skull here. And I noticed that it has this button. Oh, it's not working. Oh, well. I don't know what he's supposed to do. Um, probably just lights up. You can see there's lights in his eyes there. Pretty cool as it is, though, even when it's not lit up. I do not see the 12-foot mummy in a box anywhere. The other day when I was in here, there was a box with one sitting right up here, but that's probably this one here that they have set up. So, I don't know. He might be up above, like, in some of these rafters or something. I'm not going to go looking for him, but... Let's come over here and look at these skeletons, because look, there's life-size skeletons, like these right here, that are five feet, five-foot posable skeleton, and they light up. Those actually look really cool. Instead of just being white, they're actually, like, weathered, and they look like skeletons that the skin has rotted off. <laughs> but then, if you look to the side of those, they have these seven-foot Posable skeletons. Now the eyes don't light up on these, but look at the size of that head. Holy crap. Look at this. Even the legs are still folded up there. I would totally buy some of these. How much are these? Let's see. Um, oh, $99. That is actually a great price for those enormous skeletons right there. Let's see how much these are. Oh, these are only $35. The five foot ones are 35 bucks. These I can tell are made a little bit different with where the joints are connected. And like in here, you have this kind of teeth joint that holds it together. But Lowe's is the only place where I have seen the seven foot poseable skeleton. These things are awesome. And a hundred bucks for those is a great price. We looked at all these enormo pumpkins the other day, so let's go ahead and move on to the inflatables. Let's go on down here and start with the small ones. So they got a little display up here. I think we looked at most of this the other day, these blow molds. Oh, there's a harmonica playing a uh, skeleton up there sitting on a hay bale. That's hilarious. And then here's another skeleton that looks like it's dressed up like a witch, but what the heck is it doing? It's taking a drink of something, I guess. Now, hold on. There's even a whole bunch of stuff set up over here, too. This could just be the boxes. Um, maybe not. I was going to say this could be the boxes of things that they have set up somewhere, but look at this. Look at this circus clown. Eight-foot inflatable circus clown. This guy is awesome. He looks like a psycho with that big happy Halloween hammer. All right, we're going to come back to this. Let's look over here a minute and see what they have, and then we'll come back and dig through this, see if there's anything we missed. So right up here, we have the Mickey Mouse inflatable ghost. He's four feet tall. Here's a Mickey and a Minnie. Those are each three and a half feet tall. And we have these tiny ones here. This one's 26 inches tall, and this one's 21. Why the heck does Minnie get to be taller than Mickey? <laughs> then we got the Peanuts here, a Snoopy. How tall is he? Three and a half feet. 
We got the Minion dressed up for trick-or-treating. He's three feet. Mandalorian. We got the spooky Halloween tree. You guys know I love the spooky trees. There's a pumpkin and a ghosty on the spooky tree. He's seven feet tall, too. That's pretty cool. Oh, look at this cat. Look at this cat here. It's cat and mouse inflatable. Five feet tall. And there's a cat trying to attack a happy mouse. <laughs> we got the ghost scene with the ghost on top of the... Uh, Headstone. We got the ghost duo with two ghosts. Look, they're mean. This one's happy and these two are mean. And they're coming out of the scary skeleton. Then we have the count, the vampire. He's three and a half feet tall. Uh, here's a turkey. Here's a candy corn. I love candy corn. I'd love to have about a hundred of these all over my front yard. Just all candy corns. That's it. Nothing else. All right, we got a mummy back here. We got a ghost who's scared of something. And then we have a pumpkin here, jack-o'-lantern with a witch hat. We got the jack-o'-lantern scarecrow here. He's seven feet. Halloween unicorn, six feet. Reaper pumpkin, which is five feet. And again, that looks like that uh, fire and ice lights that kind of, they don't twinkle. They just kind of move around like in that crystal ball we were looking at back there. Look at this. Whimsical pumpkin trio. Multicolored, a green, a blue, and an orange. That is pretty cool. We got this Halloween kitty cat. Oh, this one's animated. So he's six feet long, and or maybe six feet tall, like based on the top of his tail there or something. And then his head moves back and forth like this. That is pretty cool. We got the black and purple spider. He's eight feet long. That's cool. Ooh, we got a Chucky. Three and a half feet tall with a trick-or-treat sign. A Halloween 2 Michael Myers, but that's funny. That looks more like a cartoon Michael Myers, but look at the pumpkin. The pumpkin's mad. <laughs> we got a Gizmo Gremlins. We got a Stitch from Lilo and Stitch. And then we have another um, Mickey Mouse here. It looks like he probably, yeah, pops out of the jack-o'-lantern. So he's five feet tall when he's popped out. All right, now we're getting to the bigger ones. This is 10 feet tall. It looks like, is it a spooky tree? It's a graveyard scene with a headstone and two ghosts, and then that looks like a spooky white tree. Okay, oh, and here's the clown, the circus clown, eight feet tall. He's 119 bucks. That's really not too bad for that awesome thing. Then we got this one here, seven and a half foot tall vulture looking for treats. What's this one? This is a witch on a spooky tree. That's cool. I love when they're like smiling and they have the kooky eyes. There's a cat in the tree too. Oh, and there's her broom on the top. That's eight feet tall. Wait, the eyes spin. The eyes on the witch actually spin around. That's hilarious. Kaleidoscope, mystic hand. That's pretty cool. Big eyeball that spins in the middle of the hand. Okay, and now we have the Nightmare Before Christmas stuff. We have an inflatable hanging oogie boogie it's like a doorway thing so the top is inflatable and it looks like this stuff just hangs down for you to walk through then we got a how tall is he three and a half foot oogie boogie he's cool three and a half foot jack skellington he's cool here's the tiny ones here here's a sally she's 20 inches tall and then jack skellington is 21.6 inches tall so he's taller than her this time and a couple of bigger ones here. How tall is he? Five and a half foot tall Oogie Boogie with a spider. And then we have this Jack Skellington and Sally. How tall is that? Seven feet. That's a pretty cool one right there. I like that. And look at this one here. Jack Skellington with a pumpkin. How tall is he? Nine feet tall. He's pretty huge. Then we got one more down here. This one is nine feet tall. And it's Jack. Oh, it's an archway. So it's Jack, the Oogie Boogie, with a pumpkin, and it's an archway like a haunted house. All right, let's come over here and see if there's anything else that we didn't see over there. Let's see, Jack Skellington, Mickey and Minnie. Um, it looks like we pretty much, wait, what is this? Here's a clown. Okay, he's six feet tall. That looks really cool. I wonder if he's animated. It doesn't say, but... He is a Nightmare Before Christmas character, so he's cool. Let's see what's behind here. Unicorn, Jack-o'-lantern, Scarecrow. I think we saw all this stuff, guys, except for maybe the Shrek. Six and a half foot tall, trick-or-treat, smell my feet. Shrek with a witch hat. 
They probably will get a bunch of inflatables set up along the top of this rack up here. They usually have them up there. And they still have a whole ton of stuff here that they have not opened up yet. I'm excited to see what's in that. Oh look, we almost missed these. The life-size animated creepy woman. They actually have two of them in stock. That's the one that's like 79 bucks. Alright guys, so there it is. Everything that this Lowe's has set up so far for Halloween 2022. If you guys have not watched the other video yet where I talked about the animatronics, those are over here. You can go back in my videos and find that one. There's some pretty dang cool animatronics. And just for the heck of it, let's look to see. Yeah, look at this, man. All this stuff is still in stock. Still got Freddy, still got Jason, still got Michael Myers, still have Chucky.